Here's a uh, real quick video on my new bike. It's a uh, 2023 Honda. And right there, it's a CRF 300L dual sport. Uh, normally, Hondas are red and white. This is an L version, which means it has a lower seat height from the factory. And also they changed the, to a gray and a white uh, color combo. Looks pretty cool. Anyways, picked it up Friday, ridden it a couple times, and it just came back from the shop where the new Moto X exhaust was just installed. So I'll start it up here in a second and let you hear it. Again, even though it did come with a lower seat height, I had my mechanic put a lowering link in it right there i've dropped it down maybe another half inch and also he uh he saved sh shaved i can't talk shaved the seat so with those combinations it's the perfect uh seat height for me i have no problems getting on and off and i can i can touch the ground which i, I really like to prefer when i'm riding in thailand anyways uh go over it real quick of course uh, front and rear disc brakes. There's the rear. And then uh, right there you can see the oversized uh, front brakes on it. Of course, dual sport. It's going to have the uh, the lights, turn signals, mirrors on it. Okay. Again, it's a Honda. It, it's built tough. It's and it's well well engineered, and it's going to never break down. And then coming around here, we've got the uh, billboard size right there, Thai license plate. Red and white means it's a new vehicle, and you're in the process of getting a green book, which over here is also a registration and title. It comes in a green book, obviously. So once I get the green book, I'll get a regular plate, a white plate as well. Again... Uh, I like the turn signals. They you know, look pretty cool, actually. Coming down here, of course, got the uh, foot pegs there. Again, I really like this color combo. That uh, gray with the orange, black lettering, and the white number plates. From the factory, hand guards. And then coming around here, got the front. Water cool. Again, I believe it's six speeds. And there's the close up of the motor X. Of course, fuel injected. And get a little bit longer view of it. Coming up here, got the uh, instrument panel, so we can call it. Again, being a uh, fuel-injected bike, it has a uh, check engine light on it. Uh, also, I like this. tells what gear it's in here and also there, too. And then, of course, fuel gauge, tack. And I think there's some other combos you can press to get, like, a trip one, trip two. You know, typical what they put on dual sport bikes. Anyways, start it up. Let you hear that exhaust. And get the key to turn. New bike sometimes are a little hard. There we go. Hard to turn. So, sounds pretty cool. Has a nice little rumble to it. Anyways, this is a real quick review. Uh, again, it's a uh, new 2023 Honda CRF300L. And I bought this at the uh, local dealer here in Kanchanaburi, Thailand. Total cost, I think, was 
just under, I think, 36 or 3,700 USD dollars. And of course, in Thailand, they don't charge all the delivery fees, the dealer tax, the dealer prep, or what, you know, all the 10,000 little oddball money makers that US dealerships apply. Price of the bike is the price of the bike. There's no extras to it. So I hope you all enjoyed the video.